Even though he's with the Minnesota Vikings now, former Bills defensive tackle Harrison Phillips is still committed to charity in western New York. Our Julianne Pelosi was in Orchard Park this morning for his Playmakers event at Highmark Stadium. She joins us now with more. You can take the man out of Buffalo. I was worried that it wouldn't happen because you never know, are, are the kids only interested in a current Buffalo Bill? But you can't take Buffalo out of the man. I'm glad you see him. He has a wonderful, beautiful face of his. Former Bills defensive tackle Harrison Phillips is back in the city of good neighbors, pouring love and time into his foundation and passion project, Harrison's Playmakers. You'll see people who are um, blind, who have spina bifida, in wheelchairs, autism, Down syndrome. They'll participate in every single station we have. We, we, we figure out a way that they are able. I don't say disabilities, they have different abilities. The event, like so many others Harrison and his Playmakers put together, is for kids with special needs and developmental differences. My son, you know, he's been waiting for this basically since last year. Last year was his first time he did it. This is a day to make these children feel amazing and feel good about themselves. Josh Allen and several other Bills made their way to Highmark Stadium, while fullback Reggie Gilliam and tight end Quentin Morris are helping to carry on the Playmaker's success while Phillips can't be here. I had a brother with special needs, and uh, I kind of know what it means um, to everybody out here. I mean, it's, it's, it's priceless, and it, it warms their heart and everything, and like, Nothing else I'd rather be doing. So I made a, a promise to Harrison last year. I told him, I said, after this one, I said, anything else you're doing, like, let me know. Because I want to be there for that because I had such a good time and I made an impact on so many kids. The new man on the Minnesota Vikings is still a Buffalo guy. I'm Julianne Pelusi, Channel 2 Sports.